My name is Jeff Semidowski. I've uh, been a professional chainsaw carver for 13 years. Uh, I've carved all over the country. I've carved over in Europe. Um, it's, a, it's, a, it's a talent I discovered through, through just trial and error. Uh, I'm 100% self-taught and uh, I just like to create new and exciting pieces. Pieces like this is a, uh, just an expression of my artistry. I like to take different compositions and, and put them together and create scenes. I'm originally from Shelton, Connecticut, and I carved there for 10 years. Three and a half years ago, I decided to get uh, go on the road and see what, see what else is out there. Uh, it's taken me up to the Pacific Northwest. Uh, I love this area, I love the wood, and uh, I hope to create new and exciting pieces out here. I started carving, uh, I had a, I, my background was in uh, outdoor adventure sports. Um, I, I built houses during the, during the winters and I climbed mountains and guided rivers and did all that through my, uh, right after high school. Um, four years later, uh, I had an injury in Jackson Hole, Wyoming, which led me back to Connecticut, which led me back to uh, uh, figuring something else out um, and I discovered uh, I saw a, a, a chainsaw carved bear one day and I said I can do that and that was the start of it and I haven't stopped since. My favorite wood is uh, western red cedar that's a big part of why I'm out on the Pacific Northwest now. Um, on the East Coast we we use eastern white pine which is a great wood to carve but uh, I, I find the texturing and the detail and the, just the overall uh, stability of western red cedar is, is the finest for my, my wood products. When I came out to the west coast for the first time I competed with some of the best in the world and they really showed me a lot of, of how to pick up your speed and endurance and accuracy. Um, since then I've, been, I've competed in the World Cup in Germany twice taking second place my first year out. Uh, next year I was allotted uh, team, U, team captain for Team USA. It's a three-man team, and I was chosen team captain for the World Cups next year, so that should be interesting. I do like the, the art of competition, but I prefer to be in my shop and to uh, really slow down and put in the finest of fine details. Uh, chainsaws are one of many tools that I use. Uh, I, I use a lot of different hand tools to get to my finer uh, detail. Uh, I feel that the, the piece can be taken further than just the chainsaw. We have Ken Packy. He's from Otis, Massachusetts. Ken actually saw me years ago at a at a uh, uh, I was doing a show, a logging show in Hartford, Connecticut, and I was doing a demonstration there. Um, we didn't realize it till years later, but uh, I was the inspiration for him to start carving. He is now a, a world class um, competitive carver, and he's going to his uh, the World Cup for the first time this year, and uh, I think he's going to do very well. Uh, he came out to the West Coast. For, for a month just to uh, uh, to feed off, we, we feed off each other when we get good carvers together, um, we learn from each other, um, four eyes or six eyes are better than, than two. Uh, a lot of times I, I, I can't figure out a problem in the piece, uh, there's, there's something not anatomically correct and uh, having another experienced carver uh, sometimes helps though.